Hello Leo, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of October 23rd through the 30th of 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid Cards by Lucy Cavendish. I want to thank everybody for like, share, and subscribing and setting up personal readings. If you like a personal reading, check in the description box below, email me and we can set something up. Okay? All right, let's get this show on the road. What's going on with the Leo? Leo, Leo, Leo. Love reading October 23rd through the 30th, 2017. Leo, Leo, Leo. All right, so we're dealing with somebody who feels like they deserve everything. I think this could be you and your partner, Leo, since it's the overall card. All right, so... It seems like there's been a bit of um, basically self-love going on. It's just like it's an all about me situation going on here. Like I'm, I'm somebody getting themselves together uh, mentally or they have themselves together mentally and they just like it's my way and this is how it's going to be. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, I feel like Leo is leaving things behind. It's my way. This is how it's going to be. Take it or leave it. And I feel like you might have got rid of a lot of people this week or you're getting ready to. Okay? A lot of people or a lot of drama. I feel like no more drama. Okay, so it seems like some secrets are coming out this week. Maybe you just found out something, but... Instead of pissing you off, it made you stronger. Like, oh, I know exactly what this is, and I know what to do about it. Let's see what this secret is. What is this secret about for the Leo? Love reading. Okay, so you found out somebody has been dishonest to you, and you, like, cut it. Cut it. you like, I'm not about to sit up here and play these games. Uh, I know what I want, and I know what I don't want, and I don't want a liar. All right? So it seems like there is love in this situation, but this person is just a liar. So I feel like it's too many little white lies and it just makes you not trust this person. But there's love there. Leo, Leo, Leo. All right, so it seems like um, somebody feels like somebody, I feel like this might be you. You feel like somebody is invading your personal space. So this person is probably going through your stuff, going through your phone, just doing a little stalking stuff, you know, and you just like, I can't deal with this. You know, I love you, but this is too much. Okay, so it seems like this person is also trying to get you to sacrifice something or you're trying to get this person to stop doing something. Okay, what's under here? All right, so I feel like I'm feeling like you were trying to get somebody to do something and they won't. Or they're trying to get something, get you to do something and you won't. But I feel like the overall thing is just like, it's, it's not working right. I love you, but we need to go our separate ways. That's what I'm feeling from that. But let's see what the Cleo cards say. I don't know if I said this earlier, but I'd like to read these straight out the book to ensure you get your full message okay all right what's going on with the leo 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 love reading october 23rd through 30th 2017 leo 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 all right yeah somebody from the past is trying to come back and recover something uh that happened so i feel like this might be an ex that you love could be trying to come back in and fix stuff up, but you don't want to deal with them because they're a liar. Okay. Hold on, I don't think I cut the cards. Even if I did, I better safe than sorry. I mean, didn't. All right. All right, so it seems like you may have been about to move somewhere or going on a trip, but it just didn't happen that way. So maybe this person was promising you a trip and they didn't do it. Yeah. Okay, so it seems like you made a choice about a situation and you had a choice and you made your choice of what you want to do. 
I think the choice might have been dealing with moving in with this person or going on a trip with it. And I feel like you're not going to do it. This says you're not going to do it. And this says you made your choice and that's it. Okay. Leo, Leo, Leo. Okay. Wow. So it seems like there may be a new love offer coming up or this could be this person that be lying. Yeah. This is your ex coming back to give you a love offer. Mm, but I feel like it's entangled some way with this trip. But you already made your mind up, so this love offer is going to work. I see this little crazy circle right here. You said this person is trying to look away from everything. You got the cup trying to give it to this person, and they like full speed ahead, you know? Mm -hmm. So, this again, somebody is trying to recover some kind of relationship. All right, let's read these straight out the book. So we got the Knight of Staffs here. Knight of Staffs. Where is he at? All right. And he's reversed. It says severing of connections, emotional or physical separation. So, yeah. So, I mean, you cut ties. You have to, like I said, you cutting things off this week. I mean, maybe this week, maybe last week, maybe this month. But I feel like zero tolerance. Okay. So, we got the Two of Swords. Two of Swords, where is it? And it's reversed as well. It says, empty words, insecure actions, and lies. That goes back to, you know, you're not, I'm leaving you because you keep lying to me about going on these trips and stuff. You're going to take me all these places. We haven't went there, but you keep giving me these bogus A love offers. Like, I don't want that. I want you to be true, you know? So, now we got the Knight of Cups. And that's upright. It says, a person arrives with an offer or a proposal of some new venture, possibly love. It may be hard to say no to such an offer. Yeah, it's going to be hard to say no because you still love this person, but you already made your mind up. I'm not dealing with this mess. That's what I'm feeling. So we got the four swords. Swords, swords, swords. All right, and it's upright. It says, uh... Can indicate lack of sleep, can show the need for some time away from a negative situation, possible illness. So I just feel like that you just don't want to deal with this stuff right now. So maybe it's not a full-blown I'm done with you forever kind of thing, but it's just like a wait, I need to think about what's going on. But it seems like at the moment, if it's a trip or anything, it's not going. Uh, and then it, there is going to be some kind of separation because you need time to think. Like, is this what I really want, you know? And, you know, there is a love offer coming, but it's coming from a liar. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs if you're on a personal reading. Check into the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a great weekend. Week, sorry.